Welcome to the tutorial how to perform a substance search in eChem portal. On the substance search page, you may search a chemical by name or number in a merged field. The types of chemical number you may search are CAS, EC, IUBMB, METI, UN or NA number. Make sure you include the number separators. It is not possible to search on partial numbers. For the chemical name, you may use the asterisk to search partial names. For example, I will search gluta asterisk to find glutamic acid. Or asterisk chloro asterisk to find dichlorobenzene. Once you have typed the chemical name or number, you may narrow your search by filtering by data source or type of information. You can then either choose a specific type of information, for example, property information, or exposure and use information, or GHS classification. Or you can choose specific databases. The type of information that can potentially be found in participating databases reflect those information types that can be found in across the whole database. It does not mean that every record in the participating database includes information on all types listed. Once you hit search, you have a reminder of the criteria on the top. And the results are displayed in a smart table. For each column, you may narrow your search by filtering or sorting on a criteria. Here you can sort a database by alphabetical order. You can also filter on a specific database. When you hover over the data source name, you will see the type of information available in that database. By clicking on it, you will access directly the record for that chemical in the database. It will open in a separate tab or window. In the Smart Result table, you may also see all the hits that may lead to a property or classification search. Let's say you would like to continue with a classification search. Select all the classification checkboxes and click on Continue to classification results. You will then see the structured classifications and labeling for the selected substance results. As before, you may click on the result at source link that will lead you to the data source result page. Thank you for your attention. More tutorials will be uploaded to help you searching eGAM portal. Don't hesitate to subscribe to our news on the contact page.